Hey guys, welcome to a new series I think I might be doing. I say might be because, I don't know, sometimes I like to think I may not put things out if it's not good enough. But let's see, this is a game that I hold close to heart. Like seriously, everything Mel Gear Solid is just cool to me. And if, you, if you've if you managed to follow with even just part of the story, saying what's this? It's not page really. What am I doing? Uh, Doctor. Uh, this new people. I guess I'll have the new one. Um, sorry, I get distracted too easily. Yes, this is a game I hold near and dear to heart. My favourite one being the first one, but you can't get it on Xbox. Which is why I've already pre-ordered the Metal Gear Solid Legacy HD collection. River. <gasps> Two years David Ata, I love you. <laughs> we had classified intelligence that a new type of Metal Gear was scheduled for transport. The whole thing stank, but our noses have been out in the cold too long. And yeah, this, for those who don't know anything about Mel Gear Solid, um, this takes place after the first one, where basically we're now hunting Metal Gears that people are trying to weaponize, change the face of the world and whatnot. Look at that sexy stubborn man in a trench coat. I mean, who is this mysterious figure? He couldn't possibly be the protagonist, can he? I don't know. <laughs> Smoking's bad. Oh, this game has a... has a big reputation of having long-ass cutscenes, so sorry if there are parts where I'm just sat here quietly appreciating the game. But yeah, I seem to have a, like an on and off choice when it comes to doing games for my um, gaming channel. I mean, people seem to like Katsura Shoujo, that seems to be my most popular one. But Bioshock isn't as well, re or nearly as well received. Apparently, I remember reading the comments like, a lot of people were like, Oh, we've already seen a billion other Let's Plays do this, and I'm like, I don't follow. Like, I didn't say this, but... You know, personally, I don't follow too many Let's Plays, so when I see a game I like, I'm like, I'm going to record myself and see if people would like to see this, maybe. Look at him, all invisibly. Oh, I need to remember how to play this game now. It's actually been a while. Oh, look at him. Oh, you can do it, Snake. Just hanging there on his invisible rope. Oh, he weren't hanging there. Oh no. Are you going to be okay, sir? Oh, the rope's visible now. Harry Gregson Williams, he is a musical genius. One thing I love about the Metal Gear Solid games, and I'm pretty sure it comes with the the thing I just pre-ordered, the Metal Gear Solid Legacy HD blah 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 blah. Long title, but I'm pretty sure it comes with soundtrack made by him. See, that's how you make an entrance. <laughs> that's how you do it. Schedule, what's going on? You'll know soon enough. I have to act surprised because I've played like especially the tanker. The thing about this game is um the tanker you can just play over and over. And me and my brother used to try uh speedrun this game. Oh this section of the game. But like I said, it's been a while so I'll have to relearn everything. So I'm not gonna be as smooth as I was before. Beep, 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 beep. 
I'm at the sneak point. Everything going okay? Stealth camo's busted. Landing impact. Oh, that would have made things so much easier. Sorry, but you're gonna have to deal with it. You're not in the military anymore. Right. I didn't plan on relying on this gadget anyway. The yeah. The sector's not so bad, is it? Privacy guaranteed? I'm happy as long as no one gives me any more unwanted gifts. You mean that thing with Naomi? And I can't say I miss the chattering Manny. Mei Ling's not so Beep. bad. <laughs> that reminds me, I Boop. have to get in touch with her again about that new Natick flashware. Diverting toys from the SSCEN again? But give her a message from me. Someone will find out sooner or later. She's better off assuming it sooner and quit while she's safe. Too true. Okay, Snake, let's get to work. Yes. You know the technical specs of Metal Gear were sold on the black market after Shadow Moses. All Ocelot's doing. Exactly. And now every state, group, and dot com has its own version of Metal Gear. Not exactly a classified weapon for today's nuclear powers. This new one seems to have been designed to wipe the floor with all the other models. The only consistent description is that it's an amphibious, anti-metal gear vehicle. That explains why this one is under Marine Corps jurisdiction. So I'm dealing with the Marines. So that's insane, so every like, Metal the Gear was like such a big thing in the first one. Of the new metal gear being transported right, I'll finish what I'm gonna say back photographic evidence. But I want you first to go up to the top level of the infrastructure, to the bridge. We need to find out where the tanker is headed. A little reconnaissance, huh? There's too much we don't know about this new prototype. Capabilities, deployment method. We don't even know how close it is to completion. If we know where the testing arena is, I can start to draw some reasonable conclusions. All right, I'll head to the bridge ASAP. Try to avoid confrontations. Our goal is to collect evidence on Metal Gear development and expose okay. it to the world. It would be best if you could get out of there without alerting anyone. Don't worry, I know the drill. We're not terrorists. Very good. Don't you forget that you're part of philanthropy now. An anti-metal gear organization oh. and officially recognized by the UN. Recognized, but still fringe, Otacon. All right, let's look at your gear. Your weapon is a tranquilizer gun converted from a Beretta M92F. M9. It's a little hard to work with because you have to reload after each shot since the slide locks. Oh, Better no. Better scavenging at the mission site. Good suppressor, too. The chemical stun will take effect in a few seconds and last for hours. You can take down an elephant with that thing. Check out the laser sight. Yay, let's fight some elephants. The effects elephant. of the anesthetic round will vary depending on what part of the body is hit. We're talking about a difference of tens of seconds between hitting limbs, chest, or head. As for the equipment... Hey, Snake! Cigarettes? What's wrong? Yeah, with you? smoking. You haven't read the Surgeon General's warning, have you? Yeah, that's his tradition in every game. He always Here's brings his cigarettes because it's so cool. They don't look armed. Hey, oh, it looks so windy. The These are nice upstanding marines, not terrorists. Don't get caught. You're in stealth mode here. Sure. This it should be that, easy. They're not even armed. Never hurt anyone. By the way, Otacon, are you sure of this intelligence? Absolutely. Hacked it out of the Pentagon's classified files myself. No I thought we we're working for America. Too good for that. But this might be a trap. Remember, there's a price on our heads. You're just being paranoid. I hope so. Those men. You wouldn't think they were anything but civilians from here. With all the ships passing on the river and in the harbor, putting uniformed marines on the deck would be a bad idea. People can get a clear view of the water from Riverside, too. The water line is too high. According to the navigational plans, this ship should have discharged its cargo upriver. It's in there, no doubt about it. The military trains you to watch for threats from the stern on a boat. That's SOP for counter-terror ops, too. They talk so much, I'm so sorry. Where is the target? Satellite surveillance is a major international pastime these days. I'd say the cargo holds, safely below the deck. Do you see the entrance to the holds? Looks like there are a few entryways into the crew quarters. The chopper. Oh no. Oh, just killed him with a knife. Didn't even shoot him. He's 
funny how sneaky and like smart they show the guys in the cutscenes yet in gameplay. The AI is terrible. Looks like we're not the only ones after Metal Gear time. Is that a chopper I just heard? Affirmative. Probably another cavalry. What's their game? Hijack? They're probably targeting the ship's controls. Oh, no. Auto. How many men do you need to take over a tanker of this size? The ship is run by a computer, so I'd say about 18 people. They've got AKs. They must be Russians. Hello, handsome. Russians? Oh, <gasps> you sure? No marine barber touched that head of hair. <laughs> he tells them by their hairstyle. Not the hats, not the guns, not the clothing. The hair. I'm transmitting a photo. Let's get an ID on him ASAP. I'm on it. Look at that chin stubble. Looks like the tanker's theirs now. K60 Kasatka. <laughs> he told. He guessed the helicopter by hearing it. Damn, Snake. Can I play now? Oh, no. Judging by the some kind of military commandos? Not necessarily. It could be the KA-62, the civil model. Look, Snake, all we need is the photographic evidence of Metal Gear. As long as we have those, we can put it online and blow the whole thing wide open. So no pyrotechnics, okay? All right, I'll do my best. This isn't like Shadow Moses. Reach me if anything happens. The frequency is 141.12. How can I check Got it. save my progress? I'll do it. I love it when they break the fourth wall. How do I save my progress? What? This is a sneaking mission. Call me on the codec when you want to save. Got I'll be waiting just past the Verrazano. I tell you, they do it quite well though. Be off that ship by then. I'll be in touch. Okay. Let's see. So that's how to go first person. I see him. Okay. You gonna move? You gonna move? You ready? You ready? You ready? Freeze! Freeze. Oh my gosh. Give me your money! Give me your damn money! Got it. Yeah, you can collect dog tags, but you can only get them by sticking people up. And then the rest of the items you can get is by dry humping them like this. Blink. Hello. Snake, go through that door into the ship's interior. Push the action button. Action. <laughs> Again, sorry. That was just a tutorial thing, but oh crap! I... What is the action button? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Push the action button. Oh, if someone started doing that to me, I'd be like, what, what are you talking about? Oh, here we go. I'm sorry, I, I'm starting to remember so many little things. Blink. Who's that? Boobies. I tell you what, this game's really dark. No, how do I... I don't know, open options. Okay, if I'm looking at the boobies, sorry, it's too dark to see the boobies. Call out to Khan. This reminds me of when we first met. What? I was the one inside the locker that time. We're equal now, huh? Not unless I wet my pants. That's all Low blow. <laughs> yeah, in the first game, you meet him when he uh, pees himself. Do I have to zoom in like that? Let's call him. You can also hide enemies. You no. Um. Push the action button <laughs> No, he's not doing it. May have to give up. No, I'm locked. There's certain ones you just can't get in, no matter what you do. I 
Might as well check them all, see if there's anything nice. Nope. Nope, I'm pretty sure it's this one, you know. I'm looking at the boobies, and I'm calling Articon. What do you think you're doing? Oh, look at him! Look at Snake! Mmm. Mmm. What, what are you doing? Oh. Sorry, I had to do that. I love This game is the best game ever for Easter eggs. No, 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 no! Oh. Okay, I got spotted. I'm sorry, I need to relearn the buttons. Sucks though, I've already been spotted. So hang on, I stick up the gun. No. No. There's a way to put down the gun. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to do it like that, just unequip it and equip it again. Okay, what have we got? Two guards. Laser sight, you ready? He's down. Tango down. Okay, if I wait here long enough. Now give me your tags! Fool! Don't be fooled by the gun that I've got. You gonna... Okay. So we can find some ammo now. Because I love doing this. This is what I love about this game. The attention to detail. Look at that. In case you ever get bored. Pretty sure there's a ration behind it. Oh, it's just bullets. See, they give you bullets to shoot those things. What magazines are here? Boobies! Oh, that's the Metal Gear I've got to take pictures of. I think I go this way. Okay, sneaky. Oh, someone here. Don't kill me. Ha, huh, you better give me a tag then. Blink. Is a cool thing. Oh, you, sh you gotta aim at a threatening spot like his head. Or there, if you're feeling me. You got nothing to give me? You got nothing to give me? Boom. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, I think it's this way. What's this? Security camera. Sneaky. 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 Yeah. Chaff grenades. Sweet. What's this way? There's a bit I can crawl in. Sweet. Blink. Rations are really useful, so I better start collecting them. In real life, rations are just food in the army, just food that basically doesn't go off, and you can. It's like a meal that you can just heat up and eat in the wild. Oh. Okay, how do I do this bit again? Um. Um, remember it's a bit up here. Oh, yes. You didn't see what I just got. I'm pretty sure that was just, I just got the cardboard box. Yeah. This is how we do it. Look at one of the boxes. That guy just went downstairs. Wait, where is he? Stop trying to call me! Okay, I'm 
pretty sure. Let's start going this way. Yeah, the, the, there's lasers there, basically. Freeze. Ah. Don't kill me. You're gonna give me your tags? Yeah, the lasers there, they'll blow up the whole ship if I hit them. 